So, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about why you wanted to do this project. What, what made you think about doing this project to begin with? Kind of what, and, and then why this format? Why four chefs, four restaurants? Um, yeah. You know, obviously I'm working at Duff and Waffle. There's a lot of talented chefs that create dishes that go on the menu. And what we have at Duff and Waffle is a different kind of scenario where we, we've managed in the two and a half years we've been open to create quite a few signature dishes. Now, we did a, a dinner at the Beard House in New York. And when we were going through the menu, I had to stand up in front of everyone and go through the menu and the inspiration behind the dish. And as I was talking about it, I realised that of the five courses, only one of them was mine. It's great because yeah. the other guys that created the courses were the chefs that came out with me to, to cook. But it just goes to show that it, it is very much um, you know, a, a kind of a, a community of ideas and thought mm. that, that contributes to everything. So the idea was to then create something that allowed them to get the credit that they deserve. To allow them to understand that, the idea was to create a platform to do that, which was a dinner. You've obviously had a lot of support in your career. A yeah, I think you have to. Yeah. I mean, especially with such a volatile career, it, it, you know, emotionally, physically, it's, it's tough. Mm. You can only achieve so much by yourself. And that's what I've learned a lot in Dr. Right. Waffley. It's not a case of coming in, peeling vegetables, searing meat, serving it. Yeah. There's so much more to it these days. And I think chefs can grow a lot more when they understand that there is more to it than that, which is understanding other people, other languages, yeah. other, languages other cultures. People like to see whether it's artists or musicians or whatever, just sort of grow and develop and, and hopefully yeah, feel exactly. like they're a part of it. Yeah. And do you think also, because chefs develop quite young, so like a 21-year-old might not have so much confidence either to like... Could be. Go out and so what, themselves. So what the, the next phase of, of the Twitter thing was, okay, now if you've got young chefs, put them forward, put them in touch, as mm. in, I'm not asking you anymore, I'm asking you to ask your team because I can't yeah. get to them. And once, originally it was quite difficult to get through, and once I think that little barrier was broken, then we've got lots of chefs and people are understanding. But then the idea is, you know, you may see this, the next Sat